Latifa says, what's the ruling on praying wearing socks? Because some scholars say that wearing socks is also not permissible because it gives the shape of the foot. Well, there are things that you cannot hide. A woman's height cannot be high, uh, hidden. A woman's uh, size cannot be hidden. So things that cannot be hidden are exempted. And likewise, the size of the foot. Nobody, normally speaking, unless those who have uh, uh, fetish feelings, etc., I don't know what they call it, would be uh, um, looking at the size of the foot because all feet look the same. Likewise, when you wear a glove, all hands look the same with a glove on. So this is permissible, inshallah, and there's no problem in doing that. To add some more information, is praying while covering the, the, the feet for women mandatory? It's an issue of dispute. Uh, uh, the Maliki and the Shafi'i school of thought say it is mandatory to cover the feet. And uh, the Hanafi school of thought and, and opinion, Imam Ahmad, and it was adopted also by Sheikh Hassan ibn Taymiyyah and Ibn Uthaymin, that it is not mandatory. So, without any doubt, it's the safest opinion to cover. Because if you come on the Day of Judgment, covering your feet while praying, nobody would criticize you or say, why did you do that? But if you prayed without covering your feet during Salat, there is a possibility, according to the Maliki and the Shafi'i school of thought and other scholars like Sheikh bin Baz, that your prayer is invalid. So why risk it? Safe rather than sorry.